Okay, so this is the calibration procedure for the Swift Pack head. As you can see, I got two probes, two scope probes hooked up to a test point number three and uh, a test point number two. Number three is uh, in my scope channel one, which is the, the multiplex signal output. And number two is the threshold level. So you should have a sheet like this so that you know what you should measure. You should measure a couple of peaks and then you should set the proper threshold level two volts below the minimum peak. So we're going to find the minimum peak first. Look at the scope. All right. What is the minimum peak? Well, we hold the signal for a minute and then we see it's one volt per uh, division. So we see here, this is one, two, three, four volts. The minimum peak here is at four volts. There's also a maximum peak at six volts, but that's not relevant. We only look at the minimum peak. Minimum peak is four volts. So we do that a few more times. Four volts. Four volts. Four volts. The other line here is my channel B. That one is the threshold level. So that one should be two volts below the minimum peak. The minimum peak is four volts. So the threshold level should be on two volts. At the moment it is one, two, two point four, two point four. So we need to uh, adjust that a little bit down. The adjustment potentiometer is just underneath the probes. The probes. You can just see a little screw here. Uh, I'm gonna turn that one, and then you can have a look at the scope. See what happens. Okay, let's see if we can do it like this. No. Okay, I'll try it this way. Okay, so we go down. All the way down. Two volts. Two volts almost there. Two volts. Well, that is the calibration procedure. So it's not too complicated. The only thing you need is a two channel oscilloscope, which not everybody has. So then it does become difficult. What we should also check is those red LEDs at those boards, because sometimes these boards generate ghost counts. And ghost counts are a nightmare because you get undercount in your bottles and you got no clue where they come from and I have seen that this particular board does indeed show ghost counts not often maybe once in a couple of minutes but it does So let's hope we can capture one. I just leave it here, wait and see. Perfectly calibrated, should not have any ghost counts.
Yeah, there was one. Yeah, cut a look at it. Yeah, this board is definitely not good. 